You're joking. You're joking. And it was like, you're a nice guy. I'll think about it, maybe. XO baby. Here we go. <laughs> Unboxing my printer. Stickers. First try. Skill issue it wasn't centered. So cute though. Great tracky, great tracky. She loves a gun, man, I stay tracky. I wore the black night test, she told me change it to the grey. Bay, I love it when the dick's on display. What you can get for 10 cents? Broken turtle. Freebie. Time to ship it. Made with love. We got our first order today, and it is a crazy one. They ordered one seafoam pearl bracelet, and three cute turtle ones. Here's the crazy part. They ordered ten bead confetti bags, making sure each bag is full. She's going to have fun making bracelets. It would take so long to organize these. After filling up the ten bags, I gave her an extra one. These are the charms I use. Giving her turtles and cute other charms. Her name starts with R. Giving her plenty of string. Here's our thank you freebies for being our biggest order. Total orders for bracelets and 10 bags of confetti. I love packing this order. Time to ship it. Let's package an order together. Making sure everything is sanitized. We have an order for two bracelets. Oh, thankful freebies. Oh, thank you, card. Boop. 
organizing my beads. I love these colors. Shiny. Cut and pull. More shiny. Beads be flying. Pink shiny. These pinks make me excited for summer. Time for white. This one might be my favorite. Making a Squishmallow inspired bracelet. Here's my Squishmallow. She has lots of different blues. I love the shells. Making this a set. All done. I love it so much. Why are your bracelets so expensive? I've gotten a couple of these comments, so let's talk about it. There's a couple of key factors that go into the pricing of my bracelets. With any small business or business in general, they need to calculate how much supplies is going to cost. Along with cost, it also takes time. Using this two-step formula, you can go ahead and calculate how much you want to sell your bracelets. We chose to sell ours within the $5 range, and we even have some cheaper than that. Our bracelets also take about 10 to 15 minutes each to make, and this doesn't include taking pictures of them or videos. I also wish we could sell them for super cheap, but it's not quite realistic. Another thing that tends to add up is packaging. Now, packaging is something I want to change for the world, and I love it so much but all these little things slowly add up. But it makes it super fun to give and it's fun to receive. When you buy from a small business, you're buying more than just an item and we appreciate it so much.
In yesterday's video, I showed you guys how to use this weed spinner. But today, I'm going to be using the automatic weed spinner. Here's the string I use. I like it. I use it for all my bracelets. We're going to take our hook and then thread the string through that needle of the eye. I like holding my bead spinner at a little angle. We turn it on and then have the fa hook facing down and those beads seriously load on so 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 fast. This definitely took me a couple tries to use. I got a little frustrated at first when beads were flying all over like crazy and I like wasn't catching anything. But it seriously just takes practice. After I feel like I have a decent amount of beads on, I'm going to go ahead and measure it and I actually had the exact amount. This is amazing. Those days are always so good. We're gonna switch out the beads. I usually honestly just take it and I dump all the beads in the bag. To save those beads for later, we're gonna take these beads that I was using to make my turtle bracelets and we're gonna make another turtle bracelet today. I'm gonna go ahead and thread the string like usual and we're gonna angle it literally the same. And it's seriously just the same process but with light beads. I'm gonna take it off and measure it. This one ended up being a little shorter, but that's okay because we're gonna add on the turtle. I'm taking a couple pearls for the turtle. So cute. And then after that, we're gonna go ahead and measure it again. It was a little big, so I just went ahead and took a couple beads off the end. I love the randomness of the bead spinners so much for all different and all you need is two seconds. But yeah, there you go. Someone was on Etsy and didn't have any sales, so I wanted to support them and be their first customer. There was lots of layers. It came with a cute note. I only ordered one bracelet, but she gave me a freebie. This was the one I ordered, it's so cute. Here's the freebie. It's a little big, but I love them.